Come on in. Welcome to our one bedroom apartment in New York City. We live right around Union Square Park in downtown Manhattan and this is our first apartment together as a newlywed couple. We try to stick to mid-century modern and industrial styles and I hope you guys enjoy this apartment tour. So right when you walk in, this is our entryway foyer area. I love this recycled leather doormat that we got from CB2. In front of me here is the bedroom, the bathroom to the left, and to the right side we have the living room, kitchen, and home office area. Right by the entrance we have an industrial storage dresser from Urban Outfitters and on top we display some hand sanitizers, wallets, sunglasses that we can just grab and go. Of course we have our masks. On our top drawer here we store some newer masks and the bottom ones are for my shoes. And some of my husband's sneakers are tucked underneath. And on here we have some more decorative items like this vase that we got from H&M with some dried flowers from Union Square Farmer's Market. And there is also a collection of matches from restaurants that really come in handy for lighting candles. We have some hooks here that's always overflowing with jackets, hats, and reusable grocery bags. And this is our coat closet which honestly is nothing special. And let's head over to the bedroom now. So here you get the full view. We really try to stick to this mid-century modern wooden vibes for the bedroom. And my husband already had this mini desk from West Elm that we really loved from his old apartment. So we decided to keep it. And we got these nightstands from Facebook Marketplace. But they look almost the same as the West Elm desk. And I think they're dupes from Wayfair. And on my vanity desk here, I have this tiny trash can from Amazon which basically looks like a large airpod case and I think it's really cute. I'm using this ottoman here as my chair and some extra storage space. And we got this dresser from Wayfair and it took so long to assemble but it doesn't hold that much clothing inside so we were a little bit disappointed but that's okay. And on the dresser here, we have some artworks and electronics. These are photographs that I printed out for my husband when we were dating. And this is a dried flower bouquet from my wedding photo shoot that I put into a frame. And I think it's really cute. And all the closets in this bedroom came with these large mirrors attached to them, which we kind of hated at first, but now we find them to be convenient. Moving on to the bed here, our bed sheets are from Brooklinen and the bed frame is from Ikea. Somehow Ikea didn't have the exact color of wood that we wanted for the bed frame so we just used my old Ikea white bed frame and put contact paper on top to make it look like wood. We used the leftover contact paper on this white Ikea bookshelf as well and I'm really happy with how these turned out considering the price. Up here we have some trays to hold all of our fragrances. One of my favorite things in this bedroom is this floating bookshelf where I color coded all of the books and I just think it's so visually satisfying. This laundry basket is from Walmart. And in the corner here we keep all of our sports equipment like our golf clubs, dumbbells and yoga mat. And moving on to the bathroom here. The bathroom is pretty small and generic for a one-bedroom apartment in New York City. We have these glass doors for the shower and a beige countertop overall. I try to stick to this neutral beige and gray color scheme for all of the bathroom accessories. The bathroom came with these shelves to hold all of our towels which came in very handy. And moving on to the kitchen. The kitchen is a pretty standard size for a one bedroom. Here we have a fridge with all of our postcards and magnets. Next to the stove here we have a rice cooker and all of our cooking essentials. I love this kitchen towel that gives a pop of color in the kitchen. 
This is an old apartment, so our kitchen countertop was actually white and had some stains on them. So I found this contact paper that makes it look like concrete and it kind of gave it a new renovated feel, which I love. And here are the cupboards and I really try to utilize the extra storage space here. And here is a West Elm bar cart that we picked up from Facebook Marketplace. Down here we have all of our bar essentials. And on top, ironically, we keep all of our supplements that we try to take daily. And here we have a Batman Tumblr car picture that my husband really wanted to display in our apartment. So the alcove here next to the kitchen is our home office area. We have our desks facing each other. Um, and here's a basket to hold all of our scissors, tapes, and whatnot. And this entire wall here was actually a mirror, which we really didn't like. So we just hung up a tapestry to cover it. This is my husband's desk. And this is a view from the home office into the living room. And here is a dining table from West Elm. The wooden chair is also from West Elm and the white chair is from Hay. We love our view from the dining area. Here is a quick full view of the living room. And this is my favorite corner of the living room. This picture of Prada Marfa we got from Society6. And this gold lamp is from Target. Here is a painting that I did in college. Here is another satisfying color-coded bookshelf. It's also organized by theme. So on top here, we have my Christianity books as well as some Bibles. And the middle two rows are some popular novels and best-selling non-fiction like Malcolm Gladwell. And the bottom row here are my husband's finance-related books. And so we thought it was really funny and called this the heaven and earth bookshelf. Here is a really cute mushroom lamp that my sister-in-law gifted us. You can change the settings and it's portable so it comes in really handy. And on the media console here we have some art books displayed. I would say the highlight of our entire apartment is this leather couch. We both really wanted a leather couch this time for our new apartment, so we really invested in this one from West Elm. We had to wait three months, but I think it was worth it. And here is a pretty affordable coffee table that we got from Wayfair. And we really love the wooden legs on this one because it goes well with all of our other mid-century modern furniture. The best part about this apartment is the view that we get from our window. We can see the entire Union Square Park as well as a little glance of the Empire State Building here. And I'm very grateful for this view because I love to watch sunsets and because we're facing the west, we get the most beautiful pink sky view every night. And this makes me so happy every time I look at it. And that's it! If you got to this far into the video, thank you so much for watching my first New York City vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this apartment tour and if you like this video, please like and comment and subscribe for more New York City vlogs going forward. And yeah, I hope you all have a great day.